Hi, welcome to the Excellent Slides channel. In this video, we will together create this awesome slide in PowerPoint. All right, so we will make this slide. So we need to create new slide. So right click new slide. All right, when we have it, just delete this default text and let's start by by this photo so click on on this photo ctrl c to duplicate and ctrl v as you can see we have the photo copied okay and the next thing we will make is are these lines and you may think how this photo is done that these lines are over the photo. So that's white rectangles, as you can see. So let's just copy one, one rectangle. Okay, and paste it. And as you can see, now we have this rectangle so place it at the really end of the left side of the photo so it's somewhere here yes it's right there all right and the only thing now we need to do is just copy it over and over and let me count how much lines do we have it one two three four five six seven eight okay so copy this line eight times so you can use ctrl c ctrl v but in this situation it will be better to use ctrl shift and drag so ctrl shift and now drag wherever you want okay now we have one copy all right so as you can see the distances here between these lines uh, are not the same it's uh, just ugly right so what we need to do we need uh, this the last rectangle we need to place it just near to the photo okay all right and now what we need to do we need to select these rectangles these lines from the left to the right or from the right to the left so the first the second third fourth fifth sixth and seventh okay now as you can see we have selected these lines what we need to do is just go to shape format section and here you have align go to the align and distribute horizontally and as you can see the distances between these lines are the same and that's really pretty all right so when we have the photo done let's start creating the text so in this slide i used montserrat font as you can see montserrat extra bold montserrat bold and montserrat light so let's start by this title section all right so i've used one shot extra mode, okay so type with caps look awesome title here and now let's just make it bigger i think 40 let's me check it 32 all right 32 32 all right and just select Montserrat extra bold Montserrat extra bold all right and now we need we need color to this text right so select all the tractors by ctrl and a 
and now we don't want to use just uh, default colors in PowerPoint we just want to take color of this blue sky from this picture so what we need to do select all the characters like I said before and here you have eyedropper if you don't know eyedropper tool I've already created tutorial about this tool and it should pop up now in right top of your screen so check it out okay so select eyedropper and as you can see now I have the preview what the color I would like to pick so let's take yeah this blue this blue is okay all right so here we had subtitle if you would like so let's what is the font font is Montserrat and the bolt all right so subtitle if you would like and Montserrat and bolt but as you can see we made the same font but we have a uh, different results so what is different here in this text the spacing between letters is completely different if you would like to find out something more about this topic so i i've already created also the video so in the right top edge of your screen it should now pop up so check it out so um we have here expanded spacing by 10 points so let's make the same in our in our text and font size 12 okay so font size 12 all right we have it and now expand spacing by 10 points all right so we have something similar okay and now we would like to create this line this rectangle it's really easy so i will just copy it okay Control v to paste all right now this text it's also really easy to create it's just a lorem ipsum okay so i will i will show you how to create lorem ipsum basically what lorem ipsum is it's just a it's not a real text it's just a text um, that help us to to find out if the design will look cool or not i will show you what i mean so if you would like to paste lorem ipsum so just the ready texts what you need to do is to create a text box and all right so we have equal lorem and now in brackets let's say one all right and now you click enter and as you can see powerpoint automatically created texts for you if you like it's one paragraph if you would like three or two paragraphs so the same thing equals lorem lorem and in brackets let's say free and you will get free paragraphs as you can see i i've used only one paragraph so use one lorem one all right and what's the font font is montserrat light and 14 all right montserrat light and 14 14 all right and the color is gray this one this gray it's it's really appealing color this this gray so use it in your slides okay and we need these two shapes and this this square so this is just copied this text 
so let's copy it by let's say control shift and drag and now let's just adjust the size and as you can see text is automatically going to the left all right okay and exact thing let's just duplicate this text okay all right and the last thing this square with with one number so let's just create rectangle by using shift and now as you can see it's a perfect square not something like that you know it's not a rectangle but just a square okay so uh, let's say this size all right remove ugly offline no offline and use the same color as we have in this text so shape fill and you can use recent colors but you can also use by eyedropper so eyedropper and drag just above this color all right so now let's place it somewhere somewhere here and let's just insert our number so one Montserrat extra bolt if I'm not mistaken yeah ah, semi bolt okay Montserrat semi bolt all right color is white so I dropper and just pick the white color and let's increase font size to let me check it it's 28 all right so we have 28 okay so now we have to place this number in the exact middle of this square so select these two objects as you can see we have two objects selected and go to shape format align align middle and align center all right so now we can group these shapes so Control and g all right and let's let's place it somewhere here let me preview it yes that's cool and one thing that we need to do is of course to align these all objects to the left because as you can see the difference that's the or original slide and that's that we are creating now it's a mess as you can see so all right so let's this object drag to the left this also slightly you can also use arrow keys yes that's a convenient these texts to the right a little bit all right and the last let me show you Yeah, a little bit to the right. But this title and subtitle should be a little bit higher. So let's preview it. Yeah. Yes, that's that's quite cool. In this video, that was all. I hope you will like this slide design check also different videos among others about eyedropper and changing letter spacing have a great day lead a happy life excellent slides